Hello and welcome to this tips and tricks video for Zoom Text 10. In today's video, we're going to show you the differences between App Reader and Doc Reader. App Reader and Doc Reader are your two primary reading tools in Zoom Text. They both function in the same way in that they'll both read something from start to finish, but their main difference lies in their visual appearance and where they begin reading from. Let's take a look at Doc Reader first. Here, I have a Microsoft Word document open. Now I can launch Doc Reader by clicking on its icon on the Reader tab or pressing Alt Shift D on the keyboard. Doc Reader will always start from the beginning of the visible page or at the text cursor position. Notice once we start Doc Reader, we're taken to a completely different interface with the text from our document appearing on screen. This is called the prompter view as it resembles a TV teleprompter. Many people prefer this because new text scrolls up from the bottom with no side-to-side -side scrolling. Play. The Gettysburg Address, four score and seven years ago our fathers brought forth on this continent a new nation, conceived in liberty and dedicated to the proposition that all men are created equal. There is another view called Ticker, which can be accessed by pressing the Ticker button. Ticker. Ticker mode. Here the text will scroll horizontally left and right as Doc Reader reads, and you will also see a preview of your document below. Play. Now we are engaged in a great civil war, testing whether that nation or any nation so conceived and so dedicated can long endure. This is helpful if you're reading something that has photos accompanying it. You can see the photos below as you listen to Doc Reader speaking. Doc Reader also gives you the ability to customize your text, background, and highlight shape and color by clicking on the settings button. So if you'd like a custom color combination, you can set that up easily. So now that we've shown you Doc Reader, let's take a look at App Reader, and this time we'll head over to the web. I can launch App Reader by clicking on its icon on the Reader tab or pressing Alt Shift A on the keyboard. Once App Reader launches, a red box appears on screen, highlighting its starting position. With App Reader, you'll need to click where you want to begin reading, which is different than Doc Reader. Before anyone can understand any functional visual improvements that may occur, notice that App Reader highlights and tracks on screen within the application you're looking at, rather than pulling all of the text into a separate interface. In Doc Reader will always start at the beginning of the web page, which in this case will include navigation bars and advertising information that you may not necessarily care to read. This is why App Reader makes much more sense when you're reading on the web. Additionally, you can launch App Reader even easier than ever in Zoom Text 10 by holding down the Alt and Shift keys and then simply left clicking on the word you'd like to start from. This is the easiest way to read anything with Zoom Text. In a normal eye, a high concentration of healthy cone photoreceptor cells are centrally located in the macula. To summarize, Doc Reader is best for reading documents like PDF or Word documents where you want to always start at the beginning, and App Reader is best on the web or in cases where you want to start selectively. Thanks for watching and be sure to check our blog for more tips and tricks videos in the future.